what's up guys welcome back to drew tutorial and in today's video guys i'm going to show you how to stop those background processes from running in your windows 11 or windows 10 pc now what you want to do guys simply right click on the windows icon here and you want to click on task manager and you can also access this by simple do a control alt delete and you will be able to see the task manager from the options here that you can simply click and you can run it right so you can easily do that and you can also do that from your run command so if you simply go to run you will have the run command here and you can simply go ahead and you can run the task manager from here as well right very easy very simple but you can easily access it by simply go ahead and click on task manager here right now once you're inside the task manager guys the first option that will be selected by default is your processes. I'm going to make this very large so that you can see all the things. And these are all the applications or processes, background processes that you are seeing that are currently running on your computer. And they're categorized, right? So here are apps. And as you can see, I have a few applications running. And if I want to end one of these, I can simply go ahead and right click on it and end that task, right? I'm gonna simply open up another task. So let's say I want to open up, um, let's choose, let's choose Brave for example, right? So let's say I want to run the Brave application here or the Brave browser, let's say. You can see right now in the task here that Brave is running and I can simply close this by simply right click on the task and end that task, right? Or I can simply end the task from here by make sure that I select it and I can click the end task here on the upper right hand side. So I'm going to click the end task here and you see immediately that the Brave browser is now closed, right? It is no longer open and that's how you easily end the task. Now guys, for background processes, it's the same. You can end whatever background processes you don't use and if you don't know what those processes are, I would strongly recommend that you put them into Google and you can simply go ahead and check them. For example, this is iCloud. Let's say I don't want this process to run. I can simply right click on it and I can end that task or I can simply do it from the top right hand side. And now this time I will end it from here by simply end the task. And you will see right here that the iCloud is now closed. And that's how you go ahead and close whatever it has. Also there is Edge. I can end this task for Microsoft Edge as well. If I no longer use it, I can do the same for Microsoft Teams. So you name it guys, there's a lot of processes that are currently running on your computer that you can easily end those tasks if you no longer need them to run as well on your computer, right? All of these processes that you're not using, these help to slope your computer and by ending these tasks, you put your computer at a better health and speed so that it can be faster. Now guys, I really hope that you found this tutorial very helpful and if you do, go ahead and give this video a like and share your comments below. I'd really appreciate that. And if you're seeing the channel for the first time, welcome to Drew Tutorial. I'm Anjo and I really appreciate if you hit the subscribe button below to help grow this community and also so that you'll never miss out when I release another helpful tutorial just like this one. Thank you very much and see you next time.